Hi, I'm Mega Chaos again, and we found an online tech profile. And this time, I am showing my uh, updated uh, Ultima Heretic deck. So I am taking this deck off from my uh, new Tone of Tuning series to make some uh, room for speed rides. Uh, this deck is still pretty nice, and I kind of like it, uh, but it is kind of kind of linear. As well as it doesn't really technically synchro summon event because uh, summoning out Ultimaya is not synchro summon. Uh, and uh, if you summon, of course, your synchro with, with Ultimaya's effect, that's not synchro summoning either. So you're pretty much actually rarely actually synchro summoning the stack. So, yeah, so this stack has changed quite a lot since last time. Um, I also now run the Hot Red Dragon Ash Archman Abyss in this deck, which is pretty nice. And I don't run uh, Hearted Dragon of uh, Nefet anymore because it doesn't really uh, do much for this variant uh, of uh, Heretics. So let's go to this deck. Of course, your one uh, Raid Ice Targus Metal Dragon to summon out with uh, uh, Atom mostly. You mostly don't want to draw it, but it can be useful in hand sometimes as well. Then of course your Heartic Engine, just uh, your um, uh, 9, uh, Heartic Dragon of Death of course the Cyber Dragon, uh, free uh, Heartic Dragon of Asset, of course uh, pretty nice as well, and free Heartic Dragon of Sue. So these all help you to summon out Ultimaya pretty much. Uh, then other monsters, uh, free uh, Dragard. It's pretty good for pretty much one card single summon uh, for your uh, level 10s or even uh, your level 5s with uh, Flamwell Guard. So I definitely I think it's very nice card in this deck. Then I also run two Tongue Twister. I think it's pretty nice. You just tribute summon it and uh, uh, tribute summon uh, at this card using Defnoid. And then you summon Ultimaya, and you can get, draw two cards, so that's very nice. And uh, then uh, what Tail Dragon, of course, to summon out with uh, your Heretics. And then, of course, Rabadra Dragon, of course, your level 6 tuner. So you, so of course, summon Ultimaya with this card. And then two Flamel Guard as a level 1 normal tuner. So pretty much to summon out my. Red Dragon Archman Abyss, but you can do some other plays with this card as well. And then the last monster is Black Lost Soldier in World of the Beginning because I do, do run uh, Lights, of course, your Heretics, and also Darks like Dragard and Tongue Twister. So I think BLS definitely defeats in here. So yeah. Then the spells, of course, the Heretic Seal of Convocation, Surge of your Heretics, and then uh, Two Forian lands protect your monsters. Then two mystical space to phone and finally one Raigeki. The traps, of course, is one of the only heretic variants that actually runs traps, so you can set them and then of course uh, get uh, the ultimate effect. So two colored haunted to revive your monsters. Uh, one uh, scrap iron scarecrow because it works pretty well with uh, Altamaya. You just, uh, of course, negate uh, your opponent's monster's attack, and then it resets, so then your ultimate effect can trigger. Then, Swallow Warning, uh, Mad's Emptiness, a Composer Reaction Device, a Ring of Destruction, a Bottom of Strap Hole, two Mirror Falls, and two Fence Chains. So, pretty much, the rest are pretty much generic traps that are used in almost every deck that uses traps. Then, Extra Deck. Of course, your ultimate Sulkin, the uh, main card of the deck. Uh, it has uh, no level actually, but it, it's always treated as level 12 monster. So it cannot be synchro summoned and must be plus one from the deck by setting one level 5 higher tuner monster and one level 5 higher non tuner monster. You control with the same level to so the graveyard and cannot be plus one by other ways. And once per turn, when a spell trap card is set on your side of field, except when you damage trap, you spell one one part tool synchro monster or uh, one level seven or eight 
the dragon type synchro master from the exadec and when you control another synchro master it cannot be targeted by um, effects or for attacks so uh, the a very powerful card you just get the free synchro every turn if you can keep it on the field so it's definitely very powerful then uh, Dragon Cytus, Corrupted Nether Soul Dragon a full attack beater, you just uh, summon it out with uh, Dragard and Lavador Dragon, so I think it's pretty powerful uh, yeah and then of course Leo to keep a sick tree another, uh, most you get someone, someone with uh, Dragard and Labradorite, and you know how powerful this card is then Red Dragon, Hot Red Dragon, Ashwind Abyss a new addition and a very nice in this deck because you can summon out your uh, Dark Dragon known to a Synchro Master from the ex deck with uh, Ultimaya and then you just uh, normal summon level 1 tuner and uh, Flammel Guard and then go into this and this has 3200 attack and it has uh, two very good effects first is during either player's turn you can target one face-up card your opponent controls and negate that turret's, uh, that face-up card's effects until the end of this turn so pretty much it works like uh, Chaos Map 106 Chant Red Hand and Contrast Hero Chaos so you can negate anything, anything on the field even normal spells and normal traps uh, and then their effect is negated so yeah it's a very nice card and second effect uh, when this card inflicts Palmer to your opponent you can target one, two normals in your graveyard and spell someone it in defense position. So that, that's pretty nice as well. Then the hot red dragon Ashwind, of course, uh, very nice as well. Uh, I would run a scar right instead of this, but I don't want to destroy my Ultimaya. So I think hot dragon Ashwind works better in this deck because it doesn't destroy your Ultimaya that is in the, in the defense position. And of course, you then of course can use this as synchro material for uh, Ashwind Abyss then of course balance of the Geopoyak Dragons yeah pretty much uh, one of the first monsters you use someone with Altamaya most of the time then Void Okra Dragon if you have no hand you can negate your opponent's spell taps then Scrap Dragon of course for destroying cards then Cleaving Single Dragon of course very good uh, Michael Dodge Lightstone, Lightstone uh, you can summon it with Ult Ultimaya as well so of course you can banish cards and then uh, one Armada's Key for Boundaries the one level 5 Synchro uh, because of course now I run uh, Flamel Guard the next is Monsters only free in this deck because we don't really need more because it's uh, mostly focused on around Ultimaya so card on the Final Charger uh, consider uh, Ptolemy M7 and uh, Heretic Dragon, of, Dragon King of Atom, of course. Uh, so, uh, this was my updated uh, Ultimaya Heretic deck. It's going to be my uh, final deck profile of this deck for a while. I think uh, there is not probably going to be much, uh, many changes. Uh, so, I hope you enjoyed this uh, online deck profile uh, for now. Uh, goodbye and Omakius. Out.